Tonight's big story, a Valley family is preparing to file a lawsuit against the Phoenix Police Department after their loved one was killed by officers over the weekend. Allie Osmond was shot several times after police say he started throwing rocks at them. Tonight, the family's attorney is sharing a private autopsy report with Team 12's Chase Golightly. The family says tonight they don't know why Osman was in this situation in the first place, saying it's not like him. Regardless, they believe how police responded to this was not right. An emotional plea from the family of Ali Osman. Give us justice, please. Please, like, it's very hard. They stood with their attorney Thursday, announcing they will file an excessive force and wrongful death lawsuit against Phoenix police. I'd rather Ali be sitting in jail than at that mortuary right now. Yes. It's been close to a week since the 34 year old was shot and killed by officers in the area of 19th Avenue and Tucky Lane. Investigators say Osman was throwing rocks at officers, which led to deadly force being used. These are actually rocks that has Mr. Osman's blood on them. Attorney Quasey Smith stood holding a bag of rocks he says was taken from the scene. He believes the rocks that were allegedly thrown by Osman were too small to cause any significant injury. I'm not stating that these were the actual rocks, but I'm saying that based on the entire area, the average size of the rocks in that area were this size. At this time, Phoenix police have not said how large the rocks that were reportedly thrown are. Smith also told us today that a preliminary autopsy report performed by a private medical examiner shows Osman was shot at least three times. All of the bullet holes are to the neck area of Mr. Osman. A public memorial will be held for Osman on Friday morning. Smith says as soon as he is laid to rest, that lawsuit will be filed. I just hope he gets justice. And I'll be there till the day, till the day ends, till my life ends to get justice for him. Now we want to be clear, police have not confirmed any of this information presented to us by Osman's attorney, telling us their investigation and body camera footage from that night will be released to the public in just over a week. We're in the Alert Center tonight. Chase Golightly, 12 News. Chase.